helping people is very rewarding, I think, uh, because of what I feel after helping people. I feel happy when I see someone succeeding in business, someone succeeding um, in their career development. Someone has changed their mindset from a very poor mindset. Maybe uh, someone was like, I cannot do this, I cannot. And you see that they are doing it. Now it makes you, you know, it's a kind of fulfillment that you cannot explain. It's just very rewarding. So my name is Beli Lachimo Mundi. I'm a filmmaker. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm also a trainer of trainers in uh, MED. MED meaning Micro Enterprise Development. Uh, this is where we train our people, mainly women and the youth, on uh, business skills and also home-based technologies. Community we are working, we have a program in church, basically, where we go out to the community and reach out to them talking about Christ. So as you go into the community, you realize that there are a lot of needs. You go into a family to pray with them, you find that they, you know, they don't have food. The mom is there and she's like, uh, in a position where she feels like she's not able to provide for the family. You go into the community, as you're just talking to people and uh, teaching them also about Christ, you realize there are so many problems, there are so many challenges apart from, you know, the need for Christ um, that people are going through. So you find gender-based violence, you go to someone's house, they were beaten yesterday, the whole family with the kids. You, find, you go somewhere else, someone is sleeping down, alcoholism because of the stress of life. You go to another house, it's just a very bad cycle in the in the informal sectors. So that is how we identify people and we are able to bring them together and just start with changing their mindset to just start thinking positively that they can do it. And then after that we incorporate them in uh, home, home based technologies that they can use to, um, you know, things like making soap, things like making briquettes that can give them money and sustain uh, their families. And you find that it really helps them to grow uh, economically. And even if they if they don't even start a business, you can see that someone <coughs> is now going out to look for a job instead of uh, going to a bar to drink. Helping people is my superpower. Like that is what I know I can do any day, any time. Without when I just find someone um, having trouble, the first instinct in me is just to help someone. I just want to get them out of that situation. So that is what inspires me every day because I want to see people living better lives and living the way we are supposed to live in this world. You know? And some of these things is just lack of knowledge. Most of the time when you look at um, poverty, it, you get that someone can really do something, but because they lack uh, maybe you know information on how to get capital, they lack information on how to manage a business, and that's it. That's the only thing that is barring them from uh, from doing whatever they want to do. Because when you go to the community, most of the time you find that um, when you're asking them what do you want to do, they will always have ideas. But the only thing is they don't know where to get capital, they don't know how to start. So with this we give them information to start things like charmers, which is a no-brainer for some people. But then they will be like, it's a half for them, like, ah, yeah, we can start a, a charmer and then you know, we get something like a revolving fund and then we fund ourselves and then we start selling bog or whatever. Helping people that inspired me. Let me start as a business person because I'm also, I said I'm also an entrepreneur. Um, I help people who do not understand how to do their business to be able to, um, you know, it's like um, when someone is in the dark, eh, you, you give them, it's like you're throwing uh, light to them and giving them a path to follow so that they can even grow their businesses. So for example, you can give them uh, skills in uh, book bookkeeping give them skills in uh, business planning that help them grow uh, in their business uh, development. So some, those are some of the things I do as a MED trainer to the women, uh, including even character development, because in business you need to know things like uh, having integrity, customer care. These are skills that some people don't take it for granted. You think it's easy things to know, but some people don't even practice those things. So, these are some of the things that means I instill in these women and young, young, young girls. Uh, when it comes to filmmaking, so we work on, um, you know, their skills mostly. For example, if it's uh, camera work, I help them in developing those skills. They ask a lot of questions, especially young, you know, young girls who have not been in practice. They want to know a lot of things that happen in the field. How do you go about the challenges that? Uh, 
you get as a, as a filmmaker in the field. So because of the experience that I have over the years, I can be able to, you know, take them through uh, the process. Uh, sometimes someone may ask you, um, as a producer, um, how do you even get stories? So you, you, you build them up in those fields. I normally say that uh, change starts with you as an individual. So you don't have to have a big platform or you don't have to feel like you are a little person who can't do anything. Just where you are as a woman, you can change one person at a time. So for me, every other time I meet with someone, it's just talking about things that can develop you, things that can change you, things that will help you positively in your life. So for me, changing one person at a time, that's how I you know, I view life. You don't have to, you know, wait to go to the TV stations or wait to have a social media platform. Just do it wherever you are, in your workplace, in charge. Whether you meet people in a social place, change one person at a time. With everything you do, with your works, the way you live, you know, the way you even talk. So that's, I think that's how I mainly, you know, impact people's lives. There's this quote by Winston Churchill that says, we make a living by what we get but we make a life by, by what we give. So for me, giving is everything. Uh, it is very fulfilling. So maybe I'd just you know, encourage people, encourage human beings um, to just give because it is fulfilling, I think. And also mentorship is about people, building people, building their characters. And at the end of the day, we see that these people become successful. And for me, that is, that is just life and that is good life.